on being better known as an artist not, and not as an idol anymore. You know what I mean? That's what I've come to establish at this point. Um, for my music to actually go um, international as possible, you know, um, to do more collabs, work with different people, to just engage in making my music bigger. That's where I am now. I would say Robbie and I found each other within the music and outside of the music, which made it a lot easier and more relevant for for me to work with him became a blessing to me, you know. Um, <laughs> I, I would say, I think, working with someone else, I would not, I think I would not have achieved what I have now. I was not going to have such an album because I needed an Afro-pop album and where else to go <laughs> to find an Afro-pop album in South Africa than either than Robin Malin, you know. Um, I would say it's not really, it's not really a question of putting pressure. It's just, it became, the song became so big so quickly that the point of where it is now, changing a single is a bit risky for us when it comes into, from a business perspective. So that's why it's actually taking us so long to bang onto a new single. Yes, we do, we do have a number of singles that we can work with. Um, we just, we are very reluctant on putting them out there because this one is doing so well. So we don't want to shake the ground of where it is now. This is who I am, man. I've always been, even from my journey from idols, if anyone can remember that, my music has always been based on proudly South African music. I love Afropop music with everything I am. I reference music from the likes of Abu Chabukani to Nana Koyote. So this is who I am. And that's why I had to be patient to get my second album out until he agreed to produce the album. Because this is what I want. I, I believe in teamwork, you know. Maybe that's why all my collabs are, are this big. Because uh, I sort of alone, uh, two heads are better than one. When I'm in studio, since I started doing collabs, if you can remember well, means all my big songs from when I started doing collabs, it was a collab. It was between me and space, you know. Like all my songs, because I believe in. Timoy, you know, Bendy Rombo, Ben Zahara, I said, hey, so baby, you need to keep my big song. So what's in Jan, me and Naima K. I believe in Timoy, you know, than me being more of a little bit me and who almost are here. Even though he will tell you, after he Bendy Rombo, I told myself, good, no more collabs. And then he begged me, and I gave some. You send with everybody. Now in my album, we don't want to see. This is not fair, you know. And then this is one of the last songs we did on the album. And then I decided with Yazi, how to make And yeah, and I just did another collab with Kara with Karabo now. The recent uh, I know, and uh, he's gonna build my album and on his album as well. And uh, I hope you're gonna love that song as well. There's a chick from uh, Botswana called Maxi. She, she she's amazing, you know. And uh, other ones, because we're still in the studio, I school not reveal too much, you know. Uh, there are a lot of artists that I didn't work with that I'm working with on this album, but most of the uh, of the artists that I worked with previously, Obo Musa, Dando, Zahara, uh, Naimake, Kelly Kumalo, they all. Uh, 